Hello again, folks. Here we are on this beautiful, sunny, windy day in Naples, Florida, offering you another beautiful boat. It's a 2012 Boston Whaler 250 Outrage. This is their offshore series, and this boat is in immaculate shape. It comes with a heavy-duty tandem axle aluminum trailer with a spare wheel and operational brakes. The gel coat is in fantastic shape. The boat was never kept in the water, always either indoor stored or on a boat lift, but most recently stored on its trailer. Looking down the port side, you can see the gel coat's real shiny. There's no scratches in it. The engines are a pair of Mercury 200 horsepower four strokes in great shape. They run sweet. They have 19 pitch props on them, three bladed stainless steel props and they have a total of 378 hours on them. Looking on the starboard side, the same thing. Nice looking boat, good shine to it. It's titled in South Dakota. Uh, the owner also has a home here in Florida. And we have the title on file. So let's take a look at the interior of this beautiful boat and show some of its really nice features. It's really loaded nicely with options. At the transom, you have a freshwater wash down and three rod holders and your tank fills. Uh, this boat includes two down riggers, which are removable. Uh, this center helm area has a built-in live well and wash down station and tackle storage underneath. Big circular circulatory uh, big circular live well here. I can hold a lot of bait. Here's your your shower system. In deck fish boxes, they're about six feet long, one on each side. Uh, the Boston Whalers offer this really nice in deck. Uh, this hatch lifts up, and underneath there is access to all your pumps. The power steering pump, bilge pump, water pump, circulate um, macerator pump, and underneath this plastic panel, there's access to the fuel system, the gas tank. So this locks down across the back there's a fold down bench seat fold up it's folded up right now it's easy to fold back down and there's seating for two or three people right there combing bolsters all the way around are in great shape all the vinyl is in like like new condition there's the helm the factory T-top is a power-coated affair. It's got a three-piece glass windshield system with a uh, electrically controlled vent window on the top. Here's your electronics box with switches on the side for your spreader lights and windshield wiper vent and wiper blade. Uh, inside the box is the VHF radio. At the helm, there's twin Raymarine. 15 inch screen uh, hybrid touches as they call it which uh, give you your combinations of whatever you want there's the chart plotter there's the fish finder and there's also radar so uh, that's nice to have twin units there's also a Raymarine autopilot system uh, Clarion stereo here are your engines, gauges, this vessel view gives you all your information for your engines, your hours, your, uh, your RPMs, your fuel system, quantity, remaining, that sort of stuff. There's an anchor windlass control here. There's also a, a remote control anchor uh, windlass control up front at the windlass. Here's all your switches. They're all in beautiful shape. Digital control, fly-by-wire technology, no cables, very easy to steer. Your bolster seats are here. These, these flip bottoms can go up or down. 
the armrests can come down. There you go. You have a choice whether to sit or stand. Let's walk to the bow. Plenty of bow seating. These are removable cushions underneath. There's plenty of storage underneath these cushions. There's also an in-deck storage area. Here's your stainless steel anchor windlass and anchor locker. In front of the console, there's a cooler type seat with a built-in uh, cushion. The cool thing about it is this unit here slides forward and fills in that area, locks in place with those two little grommets, and this whole bow area becomes a lounger. Pretty neat feature. There's a nice windshield wiper for the windshield. The T-top is in great shape. It's all fiberglass. The powder coating is excellent. There's no bubbling of the, fire, of the powder coating. Like you see a lot of times, salt water intrusion it's got taco outriggers which are installed let's see what else we got lots of rod storage underneath the gunnels there's also this nifty pull out seat chair one on each side I'm not sure why you would want to sit on the sides but anyway down below is the head compartment it's got a, a porta potty with a pump out system against this panel here you open up this panel and there's battery switches and ignition keys and circuit breakers for everything and your stereo okay there's also a full storage cover for the boat stored down here well there you have it folks give me a call my name is Dan Delisio my number is 239-571-4500 for this beautiful Boston Whaler, 2012 Whaler 250 Outrage, an excellent boat with a nice wide beam to it, uh, ready to go, and I'm not sure if you're going to find a cleaner boat. Thank you very much for watching.